if you guys do recall this is what we got for the concept and this is what we are getting for the 2024 kia ev3 standard model and that one as a gt line model guys so this means that we are talking production ready design and kind kid seek our will we have these exclusive images to share with you guys plus a few updates that we can topple this whole thing with as we eagerly anticipate the 23rd may 2024 official reveal at this point allow me to welcome you to the channel auto stop and then let me pose this question to all of you do you think that kia deviated from the concept to the kia ev3 production ready version put your comments in the comment section we'll gladly like to know and at this point allow me to begin by saying that the 2024 kia ev3 will be offered majorly in two trims that is the standard edition and then the gt line edition i'm going to go through it starting with the standard model and then i would intersperse that with the gt line as we go forward the kia ev3 is a standard edition and from its sleek blanked off fascia to its distinctive l-shaped led daytime running lights every element has been properly calculated and crafted to maximize aerodynamic efficiency and aesthetic appeal the suv has a bold exterior you and i can confirm from the images that we are looking at and that accentuates by the contrast of silver accents blacked out pillars and a dual tone alloy wheel here creating a captivating presence on the road and wherever you park it now that is for the ev3 let me just just oppose the gt line by it and design wise the gt line of the ev3 will offer a more aggressive styling cues with more rugged cladding and sportier characteristics so if you look at this particular one it's got a lot of aggressiveness with it up front the suv flounce the signature kia ev look with a blacked off grille you see that l shaped led drl blending seamlessly in the nose and you also see the cubicle shaped led headlamps and a wide air inlet in the lower bumper guys so it's basically the ev3 blacked out to make it more aggressive and more serious version of the ev3 standard model but then if you turn to the side of the ev3 gt line it has redesigned blacked out alloy wheels with white insets which actually differentiates this standard model from the gt line model so that is it but at this point if there is anything you've spotted that you think is significant enough and we didn't talk about it you can raise it in the comment section and we'll look at it but let me continue on to the cabin and so starting with the standard edition inside the cabin you can see for yourself there is a dual 10.25 inch screen seamlessly integrated in the vehicle here makes the infotainment very intuitive offering you know some futuristic cockpit experience that's both immersive and user friendly but then take a good look at the two spoke steering wheel which also differs on the gt line when we get to it so we have we've got a float, floating center console same as what you would see on the gt line we've, we've seen the front door mounted tweeters and dual tone upholstery with orange insets and this add a touch of sophistication in terms of upholstery and personality on the ev3 standard model now let's break here and try and compare it to what we are getting on the gt line so the same interior on the gt line on the inside the cabin of the ev3 gt line is identical to the standard version that we've spoken about but with some minimal changes along with a different theme so then what is the difference the most significant of that is the three spoke steering wheel with an offset kia logo look at it and the color scheming is a little bit different on the gt line as for the features the ev3 flounce the same 10.2 inch display for the infotainment and instrument panel we've got the same floating console with storage you've got 360 degree surround camera you've got dual zone climate control ambient lighting wireless charger and auto dimming irvm features in there so basically that is on the interior if you also spotted something you can let us know about it but let's go to the back end of the vehicle as we try and wrap what we got so at the rear what do you see the Kia EV3 features the same L-shaped LED tail lamp extending on both ends, huge bumper, right, with black cladding, roof spoiler, shark fin antenna, reverse parking camera with sensors and a panoramic sunroof, guys. So basically, 
you would get almost about the same rear look except that the standard model will come with silver accents whilst the gt line comes with blacked out accents in the back regarding the dimensions and specifications we do not have much except that we know the length of this eb3 will be 4.3 meters in length and now the automaker has been so tight-lipped about the powertrain and specifications because of the impending release however the gt line being the more powerful version of the ev3 the gt line will offer superior performance over the standard ev3 and that is to be expected whilst we talk about expectation battery specs and driver details about this vehicle is also under wraps but it is likely that it's going to get a electric motor generating approximately 150 brake horsepower and it will be paired with a battery pack with about 40 kilowatts to 45 kilowatts capacity and this will claim a driving range of about 500 kilometers if we look at what kia has been doing lately and as i wrap the kia ev3 will utilize a more cost effective front wheel drive variant of the hyundai kia egmp platform we know that which operates with the 400 volts instead of 800 volts sitting their models like the ev6 and the ev9 guy guys so while confirmation of a dual model all-wheel drive variant is still pending they are likely on the horizon given the platform's capability to accommodate such a configuration guys so basically this is the latest we've got so far and we are going to update this the very moment we've got these power numbers and so if you want to be informed and be updated kindly subscribe if you haven't and put a thumbs up if this was any helpful to you we want to say a big thank you for passing by at this moment have a good great day until me same time again bye bye